HMI GTA chums, I have a treat for you this week. This is the Fista 811 and it's a removed vehicle which means you can't buy it on websites but you can buy it in the LS car meet, it's discounted 30% off. 794 grand, that is an absolute bargain for what you get. I was about to customise it exactly like that, believe it or not. Um, but I can't do that because I can't just copy it. But if you buy that, just change the rims, make them black and that's sweet. Here is my version, um, it's a gold uh, Fister 811 and it's got the fuckery rims, of course it has. I'm going to customise it to start off with and then we're going to talk about performance as I drive around the city erratically and hopefully don't crash my beautiful car. This is one of the best Porsches in the entire game by the way, you need to own this. It's obviously upgraded to the max. But we're going to look at the uh, respray because we don't have any liveries for this one because it's uh, quite, an, quite an old car. Looking at some metallic colours, I'm I like the metallics. I wanted something bright like that green, but I can't, so it's going to be ultra blue, isn't it, or something? I've done a red build, uh, candy red. I don't like it on this. I was tempted by the pink. Oh, you know what? Hot pink. That is that is beautiful. It's got to be done. Um, for the secondary colour, we're going to pick. We're going to pick. Will a map work? Not quite. What we're looking for. So I'm going to go with just black and it still has that metallic unfortunately maybe if we go with the metallic primary colour and if we change the pearlescent if we make it black maybe that will make it a bit better but I don't want to dumb down the pink either where's black? come on mate there we go there we go that's more like it isn't it carbon black nice okay um, crew emblem goes in the door no, it's uh, my own special crew. It's called a fourth. Um, bumpers. So, front bumpers. We haven't got a massive amount of customization. Got those t shark teeth, and stock is still very good. I bear that in mind. And but I like I like that vertical bar. I might just leave it. Or I might change it back to stock. No, no, we'll leave it. Rear bumpers. Um, no, I don't think I'm going to change that, this is the carbon one. Although, you can make it a bit cleaner by going with the stock, so we're going to do that. Engine is upgraded to the max, the exhaust. We've got the double um, double exhaust from the top. Dual shotgun and stock exhaust also comes through the top. So we're going to leave it because that's fine. I think that is fine. Uh, plates, we already have it as Porsche, we don't need to change that. And roof, oh we can get rid of the roof because it's summer, why not destroy the roof, uh, we'll get rid of that and have a roofless option. Very good, skirts, oh these are the best skirts, the scout carbons, you can go with the streets if you want to, which I think uses the secondary colour. Spoiler, I've got a lot, I've got all the spoiler for traction bonus, yeah, it's kind of ridiculous but there we go. And suspension is uh, lowered to the max for race performance. Um, transmission is done, a turbo is done, wheels, I'll show you what wheel type it is, a track, modern mesh, and um, that's the one to go for, I don't think I'm going to change the colour, it's black, I can make it more black I suppose, um, we could go for crazy but we're not going to, and that is it, done, complete, very good car, you've got to buy it, 800 grand, it's a bargain, 795. But I like the performance on it, it's a very fast car, it's in super class. Of course you're not going to race it, you never race these cars for some reason. Um, because they're not competitive for the consistent lap times, that's because it's a little bit crazy. Now, the Spider, the 918, it's got the Twinster system, which is the all-wheel drive torque vectoring. Um, I've read about it in the comments I know. So, um, correct me if I'm wrong, which I'm not wrong. Um, try and correct me if you dare. Um, but it was, um, it was a mix. It was a um, what was it? It was, a, it was a petrol engine and also an electric engine. So petrol powered. Was it the rear wheels? The electric, the front. I can't remember which way around it was. Um, you can correct me if I'm wrong. There, I'm not actually sure about that one. But um, it was an amazing. It is an amazing car, and it's a car. It's my dream car, basically. Um, it, it did an amazing Nürburg, Nürburg lap time, it was a real winner on that, and it did 70 miles to the gallon on the Nürburg ring. Now that is crazy, that is better than a diesel engine, this is a supercar. Oh, I'll, I'll take it to my Porsche garage. Now, the thing about it is it, it, it's it got a little bit of oversteer, which I really like in the car, and um, it 
it gives it a little bit of slip, not grip. Um, it, it drives a bit like a rear wheel drive car because I think um, it's going to be 70-30 or even 80-20 on the back wheel, wheels there. Um, but it's just, oh sorry, I'm just not looking where I'm going. Um, it's just not, it's just not, um, what was I going to say? It's just a dream. It's just a rear wheel, it feels like a rear wheel drive car. And once you learn how to drive it nicely, it's good. But you're not going to get the, the best lap times and that's why you might not want it. But you do want it. Because it's the best Porsche in the game, pretty much, um, for driving experience. And I think it might be the fastest, but it's been a long time since I've driven it. Here's my Porsche garage, and you can see it's got all the best. Um, the best overall for customization and race performance might be the, um, the Groveler. What's it called? The Growler. It's a word for vagina. It's a bit uh, slang, isn't it? And also for customization, you've got the Benny's variant of the ret Comic Retro, the Porsche 911 Classic. So this belongs here with all the other Porsches. Maybe not that one, the SUV. Um, not really into those. Um, but um, every other Porsche, and your Porsche in here is very good. Uh, so therefore, you need to buy it this week. My voice is a bit knackered, but I held off doing this video. I've done it anyway because I don't want you to miss out on this. And... Uh, any questions drop them down below any comments what's your favorite Porsche in this game um, out of these lot what's your favorite but thank you very much for watching and have a most excellent day buy this car it's a five out of five experience do it